Hey guys, so today I just wanted to show you real quick what I got when I redeemed my Ulta points. I love Ulta's point system, let me just say that. They have the best reward system of like anywhere. Um, when you can, Anybody can sign up to be for their rewards. Um, and initially, you get, I think it's like you just get one point per dollar. Um, but then once you're platinum, you get uh, 1.25 points. Um, but anyway, um, I redeemed 2,000 points, which is $125 off. So if you can, save your points because they're worth the most at 2,000. Um, like at 1,000, they're worth $50. And then at 2,000, it's 125. So you get that extra 25. And um, 2,000 in no way means I spent that much to get that many points. Um, once you're platinum too, points add up a lot faster because there's so many times that they have triple points and then sometimes even five times. And then there's like one day, like once or twice a year where they have 10 times the points. And I should just like save up my money and get everything I need on that day. But of course I'm always like broke when it comes around and I can only spend like 20 or 25. But still, that's like 250 points right there. So, um, yeah. So anyway, I'm just going to show you what I got. So this was um, before everything. It was um, $151, I think. And that's not even counting the original price of the liters because they were on sale for basically half. Um, they were like $15.99 instead of... 30 something like there's either 30 or 32 or 33 but anyway yeah so it's an awesome deal I paid two dollars and fifty cents yeah so that's why I love Ulta so I was able to get some stuff that I needed and spend like nothing because I'm broke anyway um so yeah I'm just going to show you it's been like two weeks so I have been using these um yeah so First of all, the two liters I got are the Kenra Color Maintenance Shampoo for color treated hair, um, obviously. And I love this. Like, I can't say for sure that it does extend my color yet or not, and I don't use permanent anyway. I use demi permanent. So, yeah. But it leaves my hair feeling really good, clean, silky. Yeah. So far, I love it. Um, I feel like I might have a little less volume than I did with the Chi, uh, that one I liked. What was it called? Um, my mind's blinking. But anyway, yeah, so I really like it. It's a good shampoo. And I'm glad I went ahead and picked these because I had never tried them. So it makes me nervous buying like a whole liter. But, and I know, like, they're usually good about returns if you really hate something, but, uh, I'm going to try not to return anyway, but anyway, what I'm trying to say is the last time I needed to return something and it was something I got with my points, it was like a huge hassle and yeah, it was just a pain because apparently if you use your points then they can't even like exchange it for something because it's not like in their system I don't know it's weird but yeah so I'm glad I love those and then the Kenra moisturizing conditioner um, this is super thick it has coconut oil in it so it smells like coconuts um, which again I hope I don't get sick of it but it's really super thick and moisturizing which I love um, so like I do any shampoo I put it on like from about halfway down and just let it sit for a few minutes and yeah I love this it's just super moisturizing it leaves my hair feeling really good and then the Alpha Hydrox the original enhanced lotion with 10% glycolic AHA for anti wrinkles um, I did use this a couple days in a row but now I'm trying to trying to, trying to alternate um, just so it's not like too drying on my skin um, it is for dry skin but I feel like my skin was more producing more oil lately so I don't know if it's getting too dried out um but 
yeah. I did want the, to try this because I do have some fine lines on my forehead and I want to prevent other things. So yeah, I mean I'm getting pretty close to 30 now so yeah. I've heard good things about the cream version I think so yeah and that comes with 6 ounces and it was a pretty good price probably around $12 plus I used my 20% off coupon too for all of this so that's why it ended up being as cheap as it was so yeah and then um, I did get two of the Shreeha Shea body butters the original Shea um, I like the original one because that one I don't really get sick of it does smell pretty strong like Shea so if you get tired of that then don't get it but I got two of those I'm using one it's in my bathroom um, and the tree hut is really affordable and they were buy one get one half off so even cheaper so yeah I do like that body butter and then I went ahead and got um, a darker shade of the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte um, because I haven't been able to use my other one when I self tan so yeah so I do love this foundation um, I'm not wearing it today. Most days I reach for my Joanne Matte Moisture Tint because it's a little bit lighter. But this is a really great foundation. And then um, this, ooh, this Matchbox Photo Finish Pore Minimizing Foundation Primer. This has been something I've been wanting to try for a while so I decided to get the mini size because you, it's really not... Like you get just as much if not more for your money with mini as you do for the bigger one so it's no big deal to me and I didn't want to get the full size if I didn't know I was going to love it and I don't know I'm still iffy about this because if I have any dry patches it just really really clings to those emphasizes them gets patchy um but it does work pretty well for my t-zone so maybe I should only use it there I don't know so I mean it does minimize pores pretty well not like incredibly at least for me because I have huge pores but anyway yeah this is a haul but I just want to tell you a little bit of what I thought so I'm not just like here about this but I don't know if it's any good <laughs> but anyway yeah so the jury's still out on that so yeah and then the Tarte CC Undry Corrector in light medium this is something I had my eye on for a while too um, I have been using this with my Sigma uh, Soft Blend Concealer Brush just right under the eyes and it basically makes my under eye bags like disappear which they have gotten worse since having baby so because I am tired. Uh, yeah so I do really like this. I haven't worn it a ton. Some days I just forget because I'm not used to having that step but I'm sure I'll get used to using it and I feel like it definitely does help. I don't think it creases too much. Um, it is kind of a drier uh, texture. So yeah. And I like Tarte because they don't have like any nasty junk in them. So yeah. I am liking that. And then I went ahead and got a backup of my favorite bronzer of life. The It Cosmetics Vitality Glow Anti-Aging Matte Bronzer. Um, I've talked about this tons before because the only bronzer that like always works for me. Um, it's got stuff that's good for your skin and never makes me break out. It's huge so it lasts forever. Um, I mean I went through it like crazy because I use it like crazy. But you do get 16.17 grams or 0.57 ounces which is a good size for bronzer. I mean my other one is like getting down there and I got this last summer when I redeemed my points too and I've just got like <laughs> a little bit left there and around the edges so yeah I use this thing to death so yeah I went ahead and got it back up because I don't want to be without it so yeah let's see let's take it out because it's just so new and pretty it's not all jacked up like the other one so yeah when you first get it, it has a little imprint that says it cosmetics. I don't know if you can see that, but yeah. So I love that bronzer and I just want to make sure I don't run out. 
so yeah. Anyways, um, that is it for my haul. Um, yeah, I'm really happy pretty much with everything. So yeah, like I said, save your points if you can because you can really get some awesome deals if you are patient and don't just spend your points for little things here and there. Um, yeah. So, that is it for now. I have to go out and run errands with my little one before she gets hungry again. So, yeah. Anyways, that's it, and I will see you.